We all know the music. Know the moves. Know that Christmas isn't quite Christmas without the Nutcracker. But COVID has brought live theater to a screeching halt. The Alberta Bear can't host its customary Nutcracker performances, so Billings School for Classical Ballet is stepping in with four live online shows this weekend on this makeshift studio stage at the Montana Dance Academy. We're really lucky that we have this really big room. It's really comfortable. We're very familiar with it. We already know the floor. We don't have the grandeur of a theater and all the fun that comes with that. But this is also a pretty darn good alternative. Everybody wants it to be a success. So if you see anything not going well, people are willing to step in and fill holes and help someone with their hair or whatever, you know, it's just, so I know it's gonna be a success just because the show must go on. Shan Fine, who recently relocated to Billings after a professional career in New York City, even recruited two NYC friends to help, Niall Baker and Kyle Gary. They've been great. And I think it's really um, fun for the children here to see um, male dancers more regularly. It'll look a little different than diehard fans are used to. Wardell and Shan Fine have had to change choreography in a number of scenes to conform with COVID protocols, which the company takes very seriously. That's been an added challenge with this year, doing the Nutcracker, because I've never had to perform in a mask where right. these girls are. We're separating all the kids in the four different studios. So once they're on stage, they're taken back to their area and we'll stay in that area so that there's not too many people in a room. But at its essence, this will still be the Nutcracker, a ballet that still holds a special place in every dancer's heart. For whatever reason, it just persists. And new kids who have never seen it before automatically love it. And the ones who've done it all growing up through school, they still love it. There's just something about it. And it will likely mean more this year, when so much of normal life has been taken away than ever. It's huge really huge. Um, we, they didn't get to do recital. <laughs> I'm getting teary-eyed. <laughs> um, they didn't get to do recital. Children love to perform and in a dancer's life it's it's not really long. We have opportunity to continue dancing so the Nutcracker is a big deal to a lot of people. Thus the show will Go on. Casey Conlon, MTN News.